Normally after a game it's my job to be asking players and the management about their um, post-match reaction. Tonight however, it's my turn to do that job and I'm going to ask the question that I normally ask one of the players or the management team when I do go on, on, on the screen what their thoughts were in the game. I gave my own thoughts on, on the match today. We won 2-1 which was the important thing. Um, let's just not under, underestimate that fact. Can we play better than we, than we did today? Obviously we can, yes. But we need to take into consideration with the fact today that um, it's been a month since the last game. We've only played three times comparatively since last Christmas. And obviously you're not going to be um, match sharp when you're not playing week in, week out. Okay, Cliffordy could have the same point coming into the, today's game. They didn't play in about a month either. But Cliffordy were always going to be a sticky sort of side, and they really made us work hard for a win. Um, they pulled it back to one all, and there were a couple, couple of uncomfortable moments for us in the game. But um, by and large, we handled, we handled the threat they posed on us, and we ended up um, scoring two goals ourselves. Um, when you look at our own performance, Dan Brown chipped in with these two goals. The first one was an air post finish from Phil Keegan and the second one was just sweetly struck. It was a lovely, lovely finish to cap off a good performance from him. And he was unlucky not to have got a third just before half time. And we had other chances to Aaron Cannon set a force and a fine save from the keeper just before the break. And Daniel Leary, not Daniel Leary, Daniel Tool, should I say. Um, he had a shot that was off his right foot that was blocked out away from for a corner. That could have ended up in the back of the net. And of course there were positives to take from the performance today. But as we all know, we have bigger games coming up. And the lads know themselves, there's no need to explain it to them. Or that they need to open, open the gear. But we'll be looking forward to, to the next couple of games. The league kicked off in a couple of weeks and of course the Alpha Bond game in the FA Junior Cup. Um, two big games to be looking forward to. So we can take positives out of today really. With some of the performances. We, we knocked the ball around, we had um, a fair bit, bit of possession, particularly defence midfield. Okay, the final pass mightn't have been the best quality, crosses, through balls. But it's something that will be worked on over the next couple of weeks. There will be a lot of fine tuning going on on the, tr on the training ground, no doubt. Um, Mickey, Park and the boys will be certainly um, working with the lads to in intensify um, the areas that um, we were not at the sharpest today. But at the, but at the same token, really, like, like you said, you're coming, you're coming back from... So a few games played, Guy, guys coming back from Knox injuries and various different factors really. So it's really unfair to slate the, the performance but the important thing at the end of the day really is the job done, we're through to the next round into the last 16 and we're looking forward to the draw and all we can do is um, bring on the next game and try and step it up a gear and keep the run going. So that's, that's all I have to say about today's game and hopefully after the next game we'll be interviewing one of the players in management. So as, so as I say I'm going to wrap it up here by saying keep on supporting the lads, keep getting behind them and you never know what might come our way. Talk to you soon.